Before I was released from prison in Jamestown, I had matured into a person who developed a passion and a purpose to be a positive force in the community. We, as humans, don't know how, well, some of us are not taught how to cope positively with certain situations in life. So through peer support, we, we are given that opportunity to learn. So I think that's probably the best thing with peer support and getting out there and letting people in the community know that you can be you can be taught differently. You know, just you have to be willing to unlearn everything that brought you to that negative point in your life. The last time I was in prison, I was always focused on what I needed. Or no, I'm sorry for what I wanted uh, when I got out, and I planned on these things. Now it's more like what I need in order for me to stay out. I truly believe that prison saved my life, and uh, it did so by helping me form healthier habits, repair my damaged relationships in my life, and by letting me focus on my long-term recovery. I definitely think people can change, it just, is, it just depends on how bad you want it. Working here at Rough Rider helped me pick up a new work, work ethic as far as patience and dignity. Um, before, it was always save money to when I got out so I could start doing what I was doing before, which is getting back on negativity. There's lots of support out there, and uh, I know that Governor Burgum has been doing a lot, him and his wife have been doing a lot to make sure there are more resources for people out there as far as like, you know, getting the stable help with treatment and stuff like that. No, and, I mean, there's tons of support groups out there if you, if you look for it you'll find it. If you don't look for it, you're not going to find it. Either. I'd just like to thank Recovery Reinvented and everyone who contributes to giving Rough Rider work projects for us to acquire the, the job skills that we can use to succeed when we get out. Thank you for taking the time to let me share this with you. And in closing, I would like to leave a quote from Marcus Aurelius. A man's true greatness lies in the consciousness of an honest purpose in life, founded on a just estimate of himself and everything else on frequent self-examinations and a steady obedience to the rule which he knows to be right, without troubling himself about what others may think or say, or whether they do or do not do that which he thinks and says and does.